I have this clothes to wash. I even need your hair, bro. Thank God you're here. Olivia, I am talking about your fire hazard. And you're talking about washing clothes. Hmm? I wanted to go after washing this once. But my parents also have some clothes they'll need me to wash. Eh. Please now, help me go to the backyard. You see hypothetic clothes. Happy, so you help me, yeah? Let me check that moment. Thank you. Let me take it to your father. She? <laughs> your father is here. Come this way. Come this way. Sit. Your father. Uh -huh. This is Cleo's mother. Oh uh, dear. <laughs> See that? You're welcome, okay? So let us all go here. Yeah. How are you? About it, I don't understand. Chloe, are you sure you are in your right senses? How many weeks is it now that the prince lost his sight? And you are tired of staying by his side? Why? Come on. How many weeks? Answer me. Four weeks. Mom, it's not like I'm tired of staying by his side. James returned and apologized for not keeping in touch all the while he traveled. No. I just want to let you know that life is not that way. It's not that way. Mom, I know. I know. It's not like I'm completely abandoning the prince. No. All I'm trying to do is while away time and catch fun. Just someone to be by my side and move around with me. That's all. Oh, okay, Mom, let's use you for instance now. Dad has traveled. He's all walk, walk, walk. And then he sends money home. Come on. Mommy, is that what you want for your child? Yeah, I know, maybe try, you know, 
Chloe for the past two days. Chloe, what's your name? Because sometimes I wonder how you cook. Mother, I've not seen Chloe for the past two days. She, she called me and said that um, she was traveling to Abuja to see her father and that she's going to be, to be back next weekend. She called you and she never cared to call me. I don't know. I I thought she did. Dad? Are you there? Yes, my beloved Anna. I'm still here. Odoka, I I gave you my phone to charge. What happened? Yes, the the phone is still charging. It's still charging. But if you're asking if Glo called, yes, she did call. And uh, I sent one of the guards. To call you when you are fast asleep, yes. So I decided to let you be. I shall go into my room now. Doka. Oh, please take me upstairs. To tell him that for two days now we've neither heard nor seen Cleo. We're supposed to keep him alive, not to kill him. No, mother, tell me. What do we do? Now tell me, because very soon he will ask us to die her number that he wants to speak with her. Tell me, what are we going to do? I, I will call her. Invite her for a chat, one on one. It's okay if you're going to do that, it's okay. But if she's not being reasonable, ask her to see me that I want to speak with her. Uh -huh. I don't like this lies. My daughter, what I was discussing with your mother before you came in was that you have to make up your mind and marry a bit key. I've heard all you said. I understand what you're trying to say. But there's no way I would live and marry a man that I don't have feelings for. I don't love OBDK. Olivia! Mama, see, I know that OBDK has been buying food and, and giving us a lot of money. But all that is so that you will accept to hand me over to him in marriage. What makes you say that, my dear? Papa, I made inquiries. And I found out that OBDK and his family are known for wickedness. Eh? And I, I also heard that they treat their wives as slaves. And God knows I will not be treated like such. Oh, Olivia. You've been going around listening to gossips. Just look at yourself. Now listen to me and listen good. OBDK has been so good to this family. And you don't have any option than to marry him. Final. That reminds me, um, there is this letter that um, Matthew Gunnar brought this evening. He said that his wife is sick, that he cannot go to the palace to deliver it. I don't know, and I myself, I can't go because I have a lot of meetings here and there. I don't know what to do with this letter. Why do you collect it in the first place? Eh? His wife is sick. He, is go he, he will do it for me. Okay, yeah. and you people will discuss, please. Just make sure that the letter gets to the Igwe. Let me go to... Who live there? I stay in the palace. Why? 
I'll take it. I have not gone to the palace before. I'll take it. <laughs> I want to go to the palace. We're talking about you, Mary Lobi. Lobi, they cannot you go to the palace oh, to, to go and see things. Because I know you are happy only because you want to go and see things. That's all. Okay. Mm. okay let's by himself but his wife is not feeling fine and my father would have helped him but even my father is busy so I decided to bring it by myself. Oh <laughs> that's very good of you my daughter. And you said your father who is your father? Maza Kachiku Otimegu. Ah Otimegu <laughs> that's good my very good friend yeah are you the little girl he carries along and anywhere he goes? Ah, that's wonderful. You go now. So when you go home, extend my greetings to your father. Father, who's that? Oh, it's just a, a messenger that came to give me a letter. Uh, Major gonna send. Oh, yes. That's what I pull up for. So I had I had the, the, the voice and he brought me out from the room. Uh, please, can you sing that same that same song you, you sang at the gate while coming in? Demanding too much. Timmy, I told you that she came to deliver a message. I'm uh, gonna give him. Major gonna give him. So you so you're supposed to know that now the mother will be waiting for her at home. Um, Father, I've not heard from her, and I don't think you're in a position to speak for her. So, my dear please, can you do a blind prince or not see? To hear that same song again, please. Father, has she gone? Olivia, can you do that for me? Olivia? The name is sweet to pronounce like the voice I heard. Olivia, please do me the honor to sing it for me. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know that the prince condition is this bad. The prince, I accept, I accept my sympathy and my apology. I've lost the mood to sink. Udoka, Udoka, please go after her. Eh? But I, I heard a voice. I, the voice was was lovely. It was, it was wonderful. I want to hear it again. Why did you just decide to live like that? And why are you still crying? Though I can't see now, but I can still feel when one's voice is not steady. Please, I cannot explain myself. Please, allow me to go. 
Olivia, I want you to sing for me. I cannot sing today. He's my prince. And who is that? Oh, I'm not just... What are you doing out here, son? I'm discussing with someone. Has, has she gone? Yes, my prince. Okay, so, um, Olivia, please, can you come and sing for me tomorrow? My prince, you don't have to let me out. I'll be here tomorrow. Okay, um, all right then. Udoka. My uh, tell the guards at the gate that whenever Olivia comes, she just open the gate for her, okay? okay whenever she feels like on me, huh? She went on an errand for her father. Mm. She'll come. Mm, fine. Um, Jimmy has nothing to worry about again. At least, no more lying. Who was the girl he escorted up? Her name is Olivia Mother. So, uh, any news from Chloe? Sure, yeah. She'll come. Tomorrow or next, she'll be here with her mother. Oh, that would be wonderful. You see why you don't need to be distracted now? Mother, is someone distracting me. song that you're going to sing for the prince so that he'll invite you next time. <laughs> yes, a choir mistress. I have. I've been rehearsing since last night. Because... Mm. Mm. What kind of work is this studio for this? What is it? Look, just look at this. You see Obitik coming here now, this is bad luck. And you called it the bad luck. Yes, now. I don't want anything that will distract me or spoil my mood now. Hey! Don't say that again, no. Don't allow him, no. Before you know it, he'll start talking about how hey, much he loves me and he really wants to marry me. Eh. Hey. Okay, you know what we're going to do, eh? Just pretend to listen to what he has to say. You understand? When we get to that junction close to the market, we'll find our way now. Are we, are we not looking too polished for people that are going to the market? You see, you see your life. You see your life. You see what I normally say. Hmm? Is it because we don't have money to package ourselves the way other girls do? Oh. I beg, let him come. Here you are, my angel. Come on, little. 
<laughs> no. I'm just coming from your house right now. I did not see you. So I decided to come and check you here. Cynthia, how are you? I'm fine. How do you get there? Do you know? Where are you guys up to? Yeah, we are going to the market. Mm, market. Okay, market. Mm, market. Okay, it's okay now. Oh, let me drop it. Drop us? Yes. You don't have any appointment again. Yeah. You know the kind of love I have for you. Even if I have an appointment with uh, Keza from Oke Kenya, um, Barack Obama, I will cancel it just to attend to you. Huh? Right, let me drop you off. Oh? Come, my hand. Yeah. Come, let's go to the market. Yes. Uh, Obama. <laughs> Olivia, you, you're welcome. No, my queen, she's not here. She's at the gate. At the gate? Yeah. Go and get her! Yes, my queen. Yes. Olivia, you're welcome. Good day, my friends. Good day. Do have a seat. Look, I can't get high class questions. So, how are you? Fine. Um, how are you doing? As you can see, I'm, I'm, I'm good. I've been waiting for you to come and sing for me with that wonderful voice of yours. Everything is there. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so it's your turn to play. Okay, so how many seconds? Alright, 10 seconds begins now. Wait, wait, sorry. It's okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, that's the name. Okay. All right. This it's is time. Um, one, two, okay. That's ten. You have to double it. Um, Twenty. Okay. So, um, so you're done. Yeah. Ten seconds. I'm going to teach you a lesson right ten now. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. Okay. It's ready. Take this out. One. Time up. Are you serious? Oh. What did you play? Wow. <laughs> your hold on, hold on. Ah, mom is calling. Mom? Yeah. Hello? <laughs> Good afternoon, mommy. I'm fine. Fine, thank you. You? Um, he's fine. He just stepped out now. Hello, um, mommy. Is anything the matter? Y you, no, mommy. No, no, not today, please. Let's leave it for tomorrow or day after next. Mommy, please. Um, mom. Hello. Hello. But what's happening today? It's mom. She wants me to come home now. She says she wants me to accompany her somewhere in the next three hours. Oh no, come on baby, not today. I'm gonna miss you so much. 
I miss you too, love. I miss you. That's why I wanted her to shift it for tomorrow or next. Well, it's okay. It's your mom's call, okay? And you have to attend to it. It might be very vital to her. Well, don't miss you, baby. Come on. It's okay. Thank you so much for understanding. All right, let me go get dressed, okay? Come here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you could make it. <laughs> um, I would have been here earlier, even for the errand I've been running from my dad. Well, oh, there is no problem, my daughter. The most important thing is that you are here now. Um, Your Highness, the Prince, is he upstairs? Yes, he's upstairs. Yes, he is. <laughs> okay, let me go and <laughs> how is the principal? I hope he's okay. Ah, we thank God. He will be seeing the doctor next week. Mm. <laughs> Actually, I um, wanted to pull a surprise on you and get you guessing. <laughs> and your surprise and guessing does not include your daily pick, huh? Okay. Okay. <sighs> that is too close to comfort. Maybe next time when you remember. Okay, um. I'm sorry. Apologies, I'm sorry. So, how are you doing? You, you can call him now, yes? to see the king and her majesty at the palace. Yes. Okay. I should give it to him. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Hello. My distinguished senator. <laughs> Hi. Oh, we are fine. We are fine. And you? Oh, that's good. <laughs> you see, my senator, there was something I really want you to do for me. Yes. I, 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 I want you to give me the link. I would be so glad if you can get me connected. Yes, yeah, so that I will be the one to host this uh, Eastern uh, King's meeting. Yes, the one that is coming up. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs> you see, I know I can always count on you. Thank you very much. Why are you responding like that towards me? How am I responding to you, Chloe? You're just being very sarcastic. What is it? I came here for you. Are you sure? Or you came here because you were forced to do so? Huh? Jimmy, what is the meaning of that? I should be asking you that, Chloe. I did not come here for you to insult me. And I did not follow you to that boutique so I could lose my sight. So you could treat me the way you like. That's what you wanted. I've lost my sight and you're okay with it. You're okay with it, is it, it? Who's that? Who? She has gone, my prince. Is she gone? Yes. Oh, she's gone. How about it? Oh, the prince is doing well. He is doing good. Yes, there's no problem. As I'm speaking with you now, yes. <laughs> As I'm speaking with you now, he's upstairs with Chloe. Yeah, they are just eating. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
I will call you later. There's something I just want to sort out. I will call you later. Yeah. Oh, there's no problem, my dog. Uh, no, 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 no,
Cynthia, you know Olivia more than anybody. That is why I want you to tell me the truth. Please, don't lie to me. Do you think I'm wasting my time on Olivia? I mean, that question should be channeled to Olivia's parents, not me. Come on. You think I don't know that? For Christ's sake, they are her parents. For all I care, they'll be trying to protect her. That is why they might not even tell me the truth. That is why I came to you. Hey, oh, BBK, what makes you think that I'm in a better position to tell you the truth? Cynthia, come on. You are the closest friend she has. You are her best friend. And I believe she could fight in you. Fine. She's my girlfriend. It is the truth. But this, your question of a thing, is what I don't know. Cynthia, you know very much that I love Olivia. I love her so much that it drives me crazy. That is why I want to make her the mother of my kids. Because... I am not Olivia. I mean, you better go and look for her and be singing this your song. Hey, come on, Cynthia. Why are you saying this? Huh? What kind of song have I not sung to Olivia? I'm even running out of songs. I'm really tired. That is the reason why I want you to talk to her. I want you to convince her to marry me. Please, be on me. Okay. It's okay. Okay. I will talk to her. Believe me. When next you speak with her, you will get a better result. Cynthia, I'm very, very grateful. I'm very grateful. Thank you. Look, if you do this for me, you will make me the happiest man on earth. Thank you very much. Go. Oh? Ne, I have to be on my way now. There are some people waiting for me. Okay, oh? one. What do you see, girl? Okay. Person. And how much did he pay you? How much bribe have you taken? Oh, yeah. He gave me nothing. Nothing. This guy really poured out his heart. You understand? And he really wants to be with you. He wants to settle down with you. I know all that. To be frank with you, I've I've tried. I've tried to to carry on with it. To no avail. There's, there's just no connection. There's no flow. I'm sorry. That's where you go again, Olivia. You have blocked your mind totally for this guy. Just because of uh, his parents' character and, and, and everything. See, Olivia, you have to consider him, okay? Alright, Mrs. Spokesperson, I've heard you. Now, can we go to where we're supposed to go before we go late? Okay. Olivia! Ma? Where are you going? Well, I thought you were going to market. Uh, I forgot my pass. So, where are you going? Um. We're going to see Chiwen's father. He's ill. Mm -hmm. Come back fast, though. Okay. Thank you, ma. Don't waste time, mo. Okay, ma. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. 
That was nice, Olivia. <laughs> Thank you. That was wonderful. Sweet voice. Go down! Go down! Go down! Go down! Go down! Hey, you! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Oh, oh. Your money! Your money! Wait, wait! Everybody here is supposed to be a dead person, all right? Oh, please. 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 Oh,
And that's how I lost my sight. My prince, don't say that. You, you didn't lose your sight. I believe you'll see again. There's every chance that you You are not bound this way. I will not live this way. Circumstances of life. As goes to your side, and I know and I pray our chief will grant you back your side. And I know one day you will look at me and recognize who I am. I'm a raising more, I'm a raising more, I'm a raising more. You got who I am, I'm a raising more, I'm a raising more. Oh, wow, 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 that's wonderful. Olivia, you got a wonderful voice. Oh, my friends, you flatter me. No, I don't. It is that that is in you that I speak of. How? Thank you. How I wish I could, I could see this wonderful princess with this lovely, sweet voice. I wish. My prince, please stop lamenting like that. I believe that one day you'll be okay to see me, to see my face. Olivia, I like you. You speak of hope and a better tomorrow. Thank you very much. Thank you too. Yeah. Odoka, yeah. go get Olivia um, a cup of juice, huh? Ah, my prince, is that not too much? No, it's not. You need to rest, so it will do you good, huh? Um, so before he comes, before Odoka comes for the drink, why don't you just uh, give me another song, a cool one? Just get me relaxed, huh? Okay. No, no, Tapula, can you kill it? I say, no, no, Tapula, can you kill it? No, 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 Tapula, can you kill it? Can you kill it? Where's the big house? You're back. <laughs> yes, I'm back. Is it work I'm coming from? Now you know, you really stayed long. Well, the prince was enjoying every bit of my songs, so he asked me to go on and on. But I told him I had to go. Anyway, you are right though, but, but you have to watch your back. You know now soon, the, the news will spray all over the village. I'm not doing any wrong. I'm just singing to our blind prince to make him feel better till he regains his sight. That's from your own mind though. From your own heart, I'm sure. But you don't know the heart of people. Hmm. Because, 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 because. Say something else. Because if it's for people, if you do good, they will talk. If, if you do bad, they'll still crucify you. I went to see my friend that stays at Obago. Ah, Obago. That place is very far. I had to see her. It's been long I saw her. It's okay. Just sit down. Obi has been waiting for you. Obi, make yourself comfortable. Let me go and prepare something for my husband. Uh, let's go to the car. No, Fine. 
Um, um, Umali Cham. I don't really know what else to do to make you understand the way I feel. I've really tried it. That's why I want you to be the mother of my kids. What is it that is so special about me? What? Umali Cham. Everything about you is special to me. Everything. I hear. So how is everything around you? Your business, your family, how are they? Everything is fine. Business is good. I thank God for everything. He has been so wonderful to me. I thank him for this moment I'm spending with you. I hope everything is okay. You know, baby, I, I've been thinking. About what? About us, actually. What is wrong with us? No, nothing is wrong with us, okay? It's just that I've taken out time to, you know, study us. And I found out that um, God perfectly made us and, um, you know, destined us to be the perfect pair. Yeah, you're right. You're very right. Yes. We've been very good to each other. That's right, baby. So much in love. Mm -hmm. You're right. <laughs> so right now, I want you to close your eyes. Come on, just close your eyes. <laughs> ah. Not just yet. Hold on. Can I open it now? We can open them right now. So baby, I want you to be the mother of my kids. Will you marry me, Chloe? I really thought about it even when I was in London. I think we we need to give it a bit of time. We need to put certain things in place, like your father for instance. We need to know if he's gonna accept me and not feel I broke you into marrying me. No 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 so no. We could save my father. Don't even go there, okay? That's not true. You know, it's not up to two hours I spoke with my father on phone before he came in. And he assured me that he's working seriously to retain your father in his office. That is what your father wanted. Huh? You don't want to talk again? Why don't you want to accept his offer? Why? Nothing. Nothing. My dear, let me tell you. There's no way you can marry two men at the same time. No way! So confused. 
I'm so, so confused. I don't know what to do. My dear, your father is a politician and he's teaching you the way. <laughs> Why don't you call him and ask him? He may have a better answer. Why? Why are you sounding like this? See, you don't know what it is to be in love with two men. You don't know, honestly. <laughs> I... Uh... <laughs> Chloe. James, what is wrong with you? Chloe is wrong with me, Mom. No, Chloe. What is it my daughter has done to you? She has done everything to me since she refused my proposal to her yesterday. She refused? Why? Don't tell me she hasn't discussed this with you. No, not at all. Uh, well, actually she was, was saying something related to that, but uh, I was feeling uh, sleepy. James! I hate everything! Why will you come here and with my mom? Mom, I am trying to be the man that he cannot be by letting him keep things to himself. And what is that supposed to mean, Chloe? What is that supposed to mean? The meaning is that you are not acting like a full grown man who is ready to settle down. Yes! Are you insulting me? Oh, am I insulting you? You didn't think of that when you left your house to come here to discuss me with my mother. Enough of this! Enough! Jesus Christ! Two of you are fighting for Chloe, you know I love you. And I wouldn't be wasting my precious time if I don't. Well, I guess I should take my leave now. Good day, man. James! 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 Chloe! Are you in my senses? Mom, don't worry. Relax. I know what I'm doing. Huh? At least you'll be gone for like two days. <laughs> Clue, what if he does not and ruin your father's political plan? Mommy, you worry too much. I know James very well. He's crazily in love with me. Okay. Yeah? Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay, okay. But please, can you tell me what all this thing is all about? You've always wanted me to spend time with the prince, isn't it? This is it. I use this opportunity to spend time with the prince while James is away. C come on, mommy, do your calculations now. And what? You go to James, pretend that everything is all right? Oh, my dear, come off it. Tell me, who is fooling you? Oh. Tommy! Mommy. Not Chloe, Tommy! Tommy, you like to disturb yourself too much. Stop bothering. I'm in control here. Trust me, huh? Let me just go get dressed. <laughs> Mommy, come down. It's okay, Olivia. Uh, where is that? It's me, Jimmy. Oh, Chloe. Oh. You're welcome. How's everything? Fine, fine, thank you. How are you? I'm better. I'm so what do well for you. Oh, don't worry. Dad has already taken care of me. Dad? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's nice. Um, how's you been inside all this while? Yeah, sure. Um, besides, Mom briefed me about your singer, Olivia. She's yeah. doing a very good job. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You don't need to thank me. I should be thanking you for keeping him company all this while. And um, that is why I am going to take it as a burden upon myself to ensure that you are highly paid. So, um, how much should I be paying you a month? Enough of this rubbish. Well, how dare you insult my friend in my presence? I am not insulting her. All I'm saying is she's working for you and she needs to be paid. Every man has a price. I'm not 
I'm not thinking for my print to get paid. I'm only thinking to keep it company because of this condition. We are still saying one and the same thing. You're singing, you're walking, and you need to get paid. That's it. Get out of here now. I said leave. Excuse me? You heard me right. Or you want me to call the guards to throw you out like a piece of garbage? Now get out. What? You're saying all this to me? Just because of this riffraff, yeah? Don't you call me riffraff. I enjoy her company more than yours. And not you don't take me out and risk my life again. Enough! Right? Enough! I'm out of here. Rubbish. Olivia. <laughs> Olivia. Yes. Yes, my friend. Why are you still crying? <laughs> Means I didn't come to this world and choose to be poor. No, I, I didn't choose to be poor. No, no, you, you don't have to say that, okay? You don't have to say that. I'm, I'm sorry. And. I don't want you to take what she said close to your heart. Okay? Just, just, just sit down. say about this that happened? What I have to say about this is that this time you went too far. You went too far. I went too far. Stay back. Jimmy, why did you ask Cleo out? Mother, was that all she told you? She did not tell you that she was asking Oliver how much she was going to pay her monthly. Isn't it better? At least you can stay with her now that she has the time. And in two days she disappears. Did she actually say that to Olivia? I mean, in her presence? My father, that was what she told her. And when as far as calling that poor girl a riffraff. No! No, this is, I hate evil. I, I don't support evil. This is bad. Why should she? Is it not Jimmy that extended his hand beyond the royal house? Royal family. Mother, this is not fair. Udoka, to my room, please. Look, 
My dear, you are. Now you have something to play with both parties. Okay? You see? Go there. What is your problem, Olivia? Mama, it's not what you think. Eh, it's not what I think. Okay, make me think otherwise. I can't believe you are the one doing this. Olivia! Mama, I told you because of the way that girl insulted me. I've never been that insulted in my life. Olivia, you are telling me now because she insulted you. Eh, what? I want you to understand one thing. You have a poor background. Can't you see we are poor? We are poor, we are not the same. Olivia, what is your problem? Olivia, we are begging you to marry Obideke so that you will help change our lives. Yeah. What is he talking about Obideke here? Eh? Yes. Don't let your father hear this. I'm, I'm warning you. Don't let your father... This one you are here this early morning, standing outside. I hope all is well. Ah, all is well, Papa. Hmm? I came and noticed um, you people were praying. So I decided to stay outside and wait till you finish. That doesn't still explain why you are here. No, no, Chinchimo Toto. Papa, anyway, <coughs> actually, I came because um, I'll be traveling very, very far. In fact, to Medugri, to be precise. So I decided to come and check on you people before I start traveling. Ah, Medugri, yes. that means you're going to stay long. Mm -hmm. Yes, Papa. Mm. Why are you traveling? Ah, I'm a little. Mm -hmm. You know, there is this business that came out, a very big one. In fact, it's very tempting. So me and my friend, we decided to try our luck. So that's why I'm traveling. I hope the money is worth the journey and ah, the stress. Papa, you see this business I'm talking about? Huh? Mm -hmm. If it works out, the way I'm planning. Huh? Things will never be the same. Chawa, <laughs> even this car I'm driving now, I will change it to something better. My my hand about infinity. Hey, <laughs> hey, man, no. my God will do it for you. Thank you, Mama. This is exactly what I need. Your prayers. I'm going to miss you. Ah, Ibiakwa, Amalicham, Ibiakwa. This is your 419 miss. I hope it's not one of your jokes. So. Yeah. Ubi, why are you talking like that? If she's um, a kind of plain joke, that means you're traveling to Medugri. It's also a joke. Anyway, I'm very, very glad. Ubi, I'm very glad. Yeah? You see, I've not even gone to Medugri. God has started blessing me. <laughs> yes. You know, it, it, our people always say that um, the, the patient dog always eats the fattest bone. From this year, you know, because I'm learning small, small. I know, man. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much. Uh, I have to start going now. I don't really have much time. Huh? Um, uh -huh. Money. Money. How can you call this money, money this any money? Look at that, you Papa, don't worry. I'm expecting something. But for now, money. No? Mama? Look at that, you Hey! Hey, go, Becky. Eh? What is this? Hey, Mama, it's out of
Okay, do so. Use it for your toilet rolls, your hair, everything. I want you to make sure before I come back. Hmm? Thank you. I'll take from my mother's hair. No, oh, come on now. Just take it. It's from my house. Thank you. Pa, I'll be going now. Biko, then I take one here. Oh, thank you very much, my son. Hello, man. Oh, my son. God will Smile. really, really bless huh? you. <laughs> what I don't know. Chloe, I'll take that as an insult. What is wrong with you? I'm sorry. Please don't fix my words wrong. I'm just trying to pass on information. Advice, in fact. Well, ma, um, well, I've heard what it's you said, okay? okay? Sorry, ma, I just have to take my leave right now, okay? No, okay. Because something was what you said. No, sorry, my dear. Don't take my serious, okay? Don't take my serious. James. I told you, it's a mere waste of time for her. Because she's not going to get anything at the end of the day. Ma, that is what you think. We don't know Jimmy's thoughts. <sighs> my dear, don't bother your pretty head. Jimmy is my son. Okay? Okay, ma. I trust you. Yeah. Let me go up and see Jimmy. Okay. Thank you. All right.
What about your drugs? Eh? After the them all. Yes, I did, Udoka. I want you to tell me the truth. Did Olivia come here to me? Olivia? Yes, Olivia, did she come here? No, my prince. Are you sure my mom did not send her back? No, no, my prince. I've asked the guard at the gate. That means something, something is wrong somewhere. Nothing. If there is, should have come to tell you. Not when my mother and Chloe must have insulted her. Oh, I think she's mature enough to swallow her problems and die with it. Just because her majesty and your fiance said something. Hey. Odoka, I have warned you time after time that Chloe has is to be my, my fiance. I don't want to hear that, that from you again. I'm so sorry, my prince. You better be. It's, it's okay, I understand. She should have been mature enough, like you said. Let's say she's still doing one or two things for her parents. Yes. Let, let's say that. Thank you very much, Doctor. Thank you. Can you go now? Come on, let's have your service. Please, as you can see, we need money. And we are relying on Obi to at least help us with anything. It's not when you come asking for your hand in marriage, you start tossing him around. Mama, I'm not tossing no BTK around. And besides, nobody is, is relying on him to completely carry all our problems. Olivia, what do you mean? I, I will go and talk to my uncles about the money. You go and talk to your uncles about the money? You think I've not done that when we had a, a lesser problem? Hmm? Mama, it's okay. What, what did the doctor say before I got here? Hey, what else? What else if not the money? Olivia, please. You need to understand this. Because, um, eh? OPDK is the only hope we have now. Who? Be cool. Where are you going this morning? 
and see the prince. I actually know you're going to voice up this thing. Hmm? Sometimes I, I begin to wonder what's wrong with you. Hmm? No, there is nothing wrong with my head. I'm not going there to sing or chat happily with him. I'm going there to tell him that he won't be seeing me as he used to see me. Okay, I understand. I even like the way you put the whole thing so that it won't be as if you are telling me your problem or you're actually doing it. You know what? Whatever. Alright? I am also going to tell him what my family is passing through. He has to know because we can't keep depending on OBDK to supply all our needs. It's too big for one person. I feel for you. But what will I do? All I have to do is to wish you good luck as a friend. Okay? Olivia, Olivia, I'm, I'm still waiting. Olivia, she's crying, my prince. What? She's crying. Olivia, please, my prince. What is making you cry? Nothing. Nothing, nothing, my friends, I'm fine. No, you, you don't have to tell me that. I can hear it from your voice. Why, why are you crying? Just spill it out and consider it done. Please, what, what is making you cry? Jimmy told you how much he gave to that girl that comes here to deceive you people under the guise that she sings for him because of his condition. Has he told you how much he has given to me? Enough of this nonsense. Mother, enough of this nonsense. You know, the problem you have is this. You don't ask questions at times. You don't. All you do is just throw words anyhow. I am not stupid. I know what I'm talking about. One day this kingdom will be divided by a non-entity. I don't even know where she hails from. Enough of this nonsense. Enough! Now let me tell you. I know about the money my son gave to her. He is my son and he confides in me. So, what's the problem? You knew about it? Now, let me ask you. Why do you think my people call me a good leader? It's because I touch the life of people. It's because I take decisions that will please everybody. Not just my wife. You should know this. Really? Yes. Why don't you tell her to move in with your son as his wife? Excuse me. Excuse me. Has Jimmy told you how much he gave to that girl that comes here to deceive you people under the guise that she sings for him because of his condition? Has he told you how much he has given to me? Enough of this nonsense. Mother, enough of this nonsense. You know, the problem you have is this. You don't ask questions at times. You don't. All you do is just throw words anyhow. I am not stupid. I know what I'm talking about. One day this kingdom will be divided by a non-entity. I don't even know where she hails from. Enough of this nonsense. Enough! Now let me tell you. I know about the money my son gave to her. He is my son and he confides in me. So, what's the problem? 
you knew about it? Now, let me ask you. Why do you think my people call me a good leader? It's because I touch the life of people. It's because I take decisions that will please everybody. Not just my wife. You should know this. Really? Yes. Why don't you tell her to move in with your son as his wife? Excuse me. Please leave. That reminds me, Olivia, I heard that you've been seeing the prince. Um, I haven't been seeing him like you think, Papa. It was the day I went to the palace to deliver Mazikona's letter. The prince heard my voice and he asked me to sing for him. And I, I, I felt pity for his condition, so I usually go there to sing for him. But that's all there is to it, Papa. <clears throat> Olivia, you just have to be very careful. Okay? You have to be careful so that people don't misunderstand your good heart. The world is bad these days. Okay? Please be very, very careful. For, 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 for Olivia. And Olivia was meant to use that money for her father's treatment. Why? Why should you do a thing like that? Mother, you, 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 this is wickedness. What's all this? Your Highness, please don't judge me yet. This is the first time I'm hearing this. I thought he wanted to give the money to her because she comes here to sing. Or you thought? Or you thought she, she, she's coming here to replace your so-called Chloe? Chloe that was not in for close to two days now. You thought? Now, it's, it, just stop that. Stop that. Don't talk to your mother like that, Jimmy. What's wrong with you? After all, we all know that. Uh, we all know why Chloe is not always here. We all know that. But, but I'm, 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 I'm sorry. All I, all I need is my money. I'll give it to you. Okay. I'm, I'm ready for you in my room. I'm, I'm ready for the money. Mm -hmm. 
so old, you're licking the orange, Abby. You will lick one, I will lick one. Olivia, what is the problem? Why are you crying? Nothing. You said nothing and you are crying. I went, I went to see the prince like I told you. And after everything, he asked one of his guards to go and get me some money. And then, as the guard was coming out with a big black nylon, Her Majesty came out and stopped the guard. After she moved in and came out with him, it wasn't the same, the same face with which I saw the guard earlier on that he came out with. So what are you ignoring here? Are you trying to say that Her Majesty might have tempered with the money? Probably. And the guard said, I should come tomorrow and see the prince. When I asked him if it was from the prince, didn't answer me. Instead, he said I should come tomorrow. Don't worry. Tomorrow you go and see the prince. Thank him for the one he provided. Who knows? From there, he might ask you how much you received. Then you open up to him. Okay? You don't need to be sure. I okay. pray so. You can sit here. I need a lot of money for my father's treatment. It's okay. And we've not been able to get a bit on phone. Olivia, stop crying. It's okay. It's understandable that you were able to control it to have told just our son. All the same place said. And I'm sorry, but I didn't even intend telling the prince. He squeezed it out of me because he, he saw that I was unhappy. My dear Olivia, don't take this serious. So, how is your father? We are making arrangements to transfer him to a general hospital. Okay, that is good. No problem. I will speak with my son. No. I know you, you want to see my son, right? Chike, take her to him. You, you're forgetting your bag. Matter. You see, it's quite obvious you don't like this girl. Yes. It's all over you. How do you expect me to like her? She's the reason Cleo doesn't see my son anymore. Mother, stop this. Stop this! The poor girl is not the reason. What? Oliver. Good day, my friend. Good day. How are you? I'm fine, my friend. I was the one who heard one of your songs. <laughs> This is just to make myself happy. Oh, really? So what happened here, daddy? Hey! I... My son! My prince! Mother! Nobody has stolen my daughter. Somebody! 
Somebody just stole my money. I, uh, did you see my money? Mother, what money are you talking about? Hi, so... The what? Please, let me see the content. No, 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 open it, open it, open it. I have set everywhere in this palace. Let me Doctor, see what is going Jesus. On what is it, mother? I think it's money. Money? A huge amount of money. I, I, I don't know how I got it to my bag. What do you mean you don't know how it got there? I'm, eh? I'm surprised. I'm thinking. I am so disappointed that a good girl like you could be a thief. I don't know. So how, how did they get into your bag? I don't know. It's okay, man. It's okay. So you don't understand. You do not understand. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to talk about this, okay? Let's go and talk about it. So you are a thief? Mother, can you stop? So you are a thief! So you are a thief! Son, son, I will be waiting inside the You are a thief! I, I knew something was wrong with you! I knew something was wrong! Olivia, 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 stop crying, stop crying. Let, let's go inside, okay? No, no, I, I will stay here with me. Uh, let's go inside, let me give you the money. No, my friend, I want to stay here. Joker. Oh God! This is today that I came out with this bag and I got it back. Look how I didn't do money. I didn't do money. I did it. <laughs> How did you manage to do it today? Your Majesty, let's say I saw the opportunity and I took it. How? I mean, how did you get into her bag? Black magic? No, not at all, Your Majesty. She was busy looking at the beautiful house as she flung her handbag at her bag. And when she was made to look into one of the rooms, then I slipped the money into her bag. Nice job, nice job. Not to worry, I will, I will reward you, okay? I'll get you something better. Hmm? Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you. Uh, I'm always at your service, Your Majesty. Thank you. You can go back to your duty. Thanks. Thank you, Your Majesty. money from the king's palace. Accused? How? From who? Eh? Mama. Olivia, talk to me. What is it? Mama. Mama, it's a long story. I don't know why I'll go to the palace to steal when the prince asks me to come and collect money today. Then what did the prince say? <laughs> the prince, the prince trusted me and he didn't believe I stole it. So he gave me the money I came for and gave me extra. Then why are you crying now? Eh? The prince trusted you and if he gave you the money you came for and you're still crying, even though he was blind. What, what, what is your problem? Eh? Ha. Baba, how eh? is Papa doing? Yeah. The doctor and your father are waiting for you at the hospital. Do you know I even called OBDK today? I called him and someone picked his call and said that he's in a meeting. I should give him the message. I had no option than to tell him that your father is ill and we need his assistance. Let me go and boil water. You are going with me or I'm coming. Did you hear what I said? What we have to do is to write down Obidike's number for your father. At least when he gets to Abuja, he will call him. 
who knows, they might get him there. Okay? Believe me, he's going to do something. Hmm? of stuff. I got you clothes, food stuff, fruits, whatever you just name them. I actually left it with the maid outside. <laughs> oh, well, that's tough full of you, Chloe. <laughs> I thought you've abandoned me. Oh, come on. Stop it. How can you say that? Why would I abandon you? Huh? See, you're being very busy running errands for daddy. How I wish you could see. It's on the media, it's everywhere, TV, newspaper, what a view, huh? Okay, I'm gonna buy you a small radio. <laughs> that way you get yourself updated in what I'm doing. Um, you know I'm not cut out for this um, news and this, your media information. I'm not cut out for it. Um, you should be talking to my father about that. Anyways, thank you for everything, the fruit and, and thank you very much. That's what we you. Alright, so... Now I am back. I'm back with you fully. For real? Uh -huh. For real. That's fine. I think I went to take a walk. Okay. Easy, easy. Yeah. Oh, it's... <laughs> okay, we'll get back. Yeah. Mm. Alright, darling. Come on. Let's go. Yeah. I'm clear and very clear. <laughs> <laughs> So why would I be overexcited about just because of money? No, wrong guy. <laughs> then give me a tip of why you are so happy. Mommy, I had a splendid and wonderful time. Tell me, how did it go? I'm sorry. Sorry. Anyway, I would like to keep my joy. Um, remember what you told me about the clothes? Yes. Getting shopping and all. Mm -hmm. Mommy, I went for real shopping. I got stuffs, plenty stuff. I just put all of them together. Trust me, with the strength of a woman, I placed him where he belongs. <laughs> <laughs> James came looking for you, almost dying. He said he wants to hear your voice. <sighs> yeah, I feel sorry for him though. But mom, it was good I put my phone on vibration, trust me, because he would have spoiled my moment with Jimmy. Cool. <laughs> Is that it? Mommy, I don't understand you. Where do you belong now? Eh? Okay. If I'm with James and Jimmy's mom comes calling, problem. Okay, I'm with Jimmy and James comes around. Why are you doing that? Where are you going? Eh? It's okay. See, leave this whole thing to me. I know what I'm doing. It's okay. Well, I hope so. I hope so. Mommy, I know what I'm doing. Relax, eh? Don't come and stop my foot. Clean up. Travel to his treatment. Yes, ma. They went yesterday. Oh, not to worry. He will be fine. Thank you for your concern, ma. Uh, you're here to see my son, right? Mm -hmm. ah. He asked me to come. He he has traveled. 
Oh, but he, he said I was to travel with him. <laughs> Olivia, you amuse me. So if actually my son had wanted you to travel with him, would you have gone looking like this? Definitely not. Or do you think because he has problems with his sight that he doesn't have any class or pride anymore as a prince? No, my dad, that, that's not what I meant. Well, the schedule has changed. Okay, and it's not what I have to go now. Good idea. Listen, tell the other idiots that if any of you who is at that post ever allows that girl to come into this palace again, that person, that person should consider himself fired. Is that clear? Yes, Your Majesty. You will not burn this way. I will not live this way. Circumstances of life has pushed to your side. And Hello, son. Mom, good morning, Mom. Yes, I was so nice feet. Hmm? How is my darling today? I'm good, Mom. <sighs> Why did you send for me this early? Uh, Mom, I... I know you don't fancy Olivia. <sighs> but um, I want to ask you for a favor. Yeah, what is it? Uh, Mom, I want you to check if Olivia is back. And I would like to see her before I drop off my operation. Well, son, first, I don't know her place. And secondly, I will not promise you that I'll go out of my way to look for her just because you want to see her. Moreover, Cleo is downstairs. Cleo is downstairs? Yes. Oh, really? Yes. Well, she would have been here to see you. If not that, your father wants to have a cup of tea and a little chat with her. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Okay. I think she should come upstairs. Um, let me just rush over and have my back. Okay, Dad. I'll tell her. Okay, Mom. Easy. Yeah, <laughs> I know. I'm getting used to everything. I know. Yeah. Is there a problem? No, there's no problem. But I'd like you to come here right now. Oh, okay. Um, I'll come later on, since there's no problem. Uh, no, no, no. There's a little problem, but I'm going to explain everything to you when you come. Um, okay, I'll be there in uh, 20, 30 minutes. I'm just close by. Okay, I am waiting. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I miss you too. Um, boy. 
Yes, darling. Um, your mouth is not tasting like one who just took tea. Um, oh, Pat, uh, you know me, I'm always in the habit of cleaning up after taking something. Come on, you should know me better. Oh, are you suspecting me of something? What is there for a blind man to suspect? <sighs> Jimmy, Jimmy, stop it. Stop it. You know this is just temporary. Just three days from now. All of this will be history, it will be past. Ah, come on, baby. Uh, that is why I'm planning a happy celebration for you. You are? Yeah, sure. 72 hours from now, you are going to see again. You know what? I am going to book the best of the hotels in town for you. Where you will look me in the eyes and, and tell me once again how I look. How about that? Can't wait for that day, baby. I, 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 I truly can't wait. Oh, sweetie, I can't wait for it too. Well, you know what? Before we get to that point, this is where the journey begins. Come uh, here. Uh, I'm uh, trying to wait, hold you in my wait, arms. Wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not. I'm not with you. I'm not just easy. Let's try it again. I just. Just hold on. Ah. Well, it doesn't matter. I am here. Oh. I want you to stop seeing my son. But your majesty, I... You don't have to argue with me. This is 500,000 naira. Sort yourself out with it. I'll do as you said, but... I'm sorry, I can't accept this. Your loss. Take me out of here. of life has pushed to your side and I know and I pray I watch you will grant you back your side and I know one day you will look at me and recognize who I am my raising move my raising move my raising move you got who I am you so my raising move my raising move I can see. 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 I can see.
Jimmy, my son. You see, you've not been happy since we came back. Okay. I know what to do. I'm going to organize a very good party. Wonderful one. Invite family, friends, and relations so that they will come we celebrate your restoration. What do you think about that? How many of them came when I had my eye problem? Like the doctor said, my, my chances of seeing was, was very, very slim. And that is why I want to see just one person, and that is Olivia. She was the only one that gave me hope that I was going to see again. Stop talking like a child, Tim. Stop talking like a child. You know you all see again. You know it. Well, son, let us forget about everything. We give God all the glory that you're seeing again. Uh, if you ask me, I would um, advise you to apologize to Chloe for the embarrassment you gave her and the kind of treatment you meted out to her. Yes. So you really need to do that. That is exactly what you need to do now. And also, find a way to engage her. It's very important. All right. All right. I've heard all you said. But I still want to know where she lives. I want to know where Olivia lives. I want to go and check if she's back. No, no. She's not yet back. If she was, she would have been here. Yeah, she's not back. I was just going down the road, so I saw this clothes that I could take and I decided to get them wow. for you. <laughs> That's so kind of you. <laughs> Thank you very much, huh? Anything <laughs> for you, my friends. <laughs> uh -huh. So what happened? You didn't give me the opportunity of giving you a treat as planned after the operation. Maybe I'm sorry, kid. I'm very sorry. Yeah, I was... I was confused and... Excited, you know, over my sight. I'm sorry. It's okay, darling. It's okay. I've missed you. I've missed you so much. You know, I've missed your eyes. Craving. Orging. Seriously. Oh, 
sincerely, I I won't tell you when I had my eye problem. You never showed up, did you? Jimmy, come on, stop. Stop it, Jimmy. Don't tell me you've been sleeping with that girl that comes here to sing for you. No, no, not at all. I don't even know what she looks like. I I never wanted to do anything I'll have to regret tomorrow. And me. Chloe, Chloe. You are the most um, beautiful girl I've set my eyes on. You like her. A girl for every man. <laughs> But for six? Two weeks, the prince went for his surgery and he regained his sight. And yet, he hasn't asked of me. He, he just forgot the the poor girl that always sang for him. His days of hopelessness. <laughs> Olivia, I cannot believe the prince will forget me like that. I told you that we are not of the same class with the prince, but you wouldn't listen. I warned you beforehand. No. I was I was poor when I sang for him. Why? I've warned you before and I'm still repeating it. We are not of the same class with the prince. You have a poor background, you're from a poor family. Can't you get it? Because, my daughter, please wipe your tears. Oh, forget about the prince. Inugu. Good afternoon. I'm fine. Fine, thank you. Um, Your Majesty, that's actually why I'm calling. Yeah, I've been making advances at him, but he's been bluffing. I just 
don't know. I think he's beginning to suspect something. Okay, okay. Fine, I'm actually dressing up. You just finish. I'll be there with you shortly. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much, man. All right. that girl who saw the gate. This is like the third time I'm seeing her. Is she looking for someone? I don't know how my priest. Maybe she might be one of the girls that ways to get priest's attention. Maybe she's shy. What do you mean by she's shy? She might be one of the village girls. Do mention anything about that girl to my son, no matter the pressure. Is that clear? Yes, Your Majesty. It is not just yes, Your Majesty. If you do that, you will have me to contend with. I swear, I don't know that girl. I've never seen her before. Very well then. Udoka, if you keep to your word, I'm going to reward you bountifully. Always at a service. It's okay. You can go back to your duty post. Oh, 
Odoka, I hope you know why I took only you for this trip. My prince, maybe because you want me to select some clothes with you, uh, because I'm more closer to you than other girls. Not just that. I also want us to see that girl. Which girl, my prince? Olivia, of course. Olivia. I told you, I, I don't know anything about her. You don't know anything about her? Then why are, why, why, why are we here? Huh? Whole truth and nothing but the truth. Where are you two coming back from? The prince told me we are going to the boutique. But along the road, he said I should take him to the girl's house. Mm-hmm. And what did you do? I simply told him I don't know the girl's house. Are you sure? Don't tell me. Don't you ever tell me. My God. What do I do right now? Whom do I tackle first? My son or the God? My son? Oh no. The guard? Yes. Yes, because if my son should pressurize him, he might start singing a bad song. So what do I do to him? Send him back in? Oh no. The king will refuse and start asking questions. That is the right thing to do. When he steals my money, I have no other option. Let me see what he will do from his mother's house. confusing dream last night and I couldn't even tell my parents. Why? Okay, tell me. What's the dream all about? It was about you. You and Obidike. Me and Obidike. What for? You people were wedding. Olivia, enough of all these your jokes. I mean, this is a joke that I can have for a whole year. Hmm? You know I don't joke with things like this. And the, the wedding seems so real. Olivia, your head needs to be examined. I'm telling you, your head needs to be examined. Why? Because I told you my dream. Olivia, everybody knows that your dream is real. 
But that's not enough reason for you to visualize all this thing and call them dreams. Please, you are kidding me. You are kidding. Uh, well, I wish I was joking. Because I went back to sleep and the same dream repeated itself again. Only then. You can't be serious. I mean, you and I know that I don't have anything to do with it. It can't be serious, so. I'm, I'm glad I, I told someone about it. Your Highness, what I'm saying is that all Jimmy is thinking about now is that girl. He's beginning to lose interest in Chloe. Father, that's not true. Mother here is always making me feel like a child. Of course you're my child. And you will forever remain my child, Jim. I won't argue that, Mother. But I'm old enough to know the woman I want in my life. It better be. Jimmy, it better be. You see, you don't need me to be told that if you don't marry this girl, it will definitely jeopardize the relationship between both families. And you know what it means. You know it. But I still won't change anything. We can still have same privileges somewhere else. Chike! Chike! That's my prince. Um, where else the doctor? I've not seen him since yesterday. My prince, I don't know his whereabouts. The doctor, right? Yeah. He has chosen his right path. Mother, what do you mean Udoka has chosen the right path? Udoka's door. What? And unfortunately he was caught, so I had to dismiss him. Mother, where have I been when all this will happen? Is father aware of this? Of course he's aware. Father is aware of it? Yes. That you have left the palace, what do you intend doing? Left the palace? That's not true, Mama. I believe I came home for suspension. Udo, don't start now. You don't need somebody to tell you that you're no more going in there. Mama, don't worry yourself, eh? See how um, I know what to do. Then you see me back on top. I'm more better. You are all I have left. I don't want to miss any of you, okay? It's not even you. Beautiful. Why is that thing like this? Huh? You are going too far. You go. If I'm going too far, bring me too close. No, if I'm going too far, bring me too close. Don't worry. I promise you everything will be all right. Huh? I promise you everything will be all right.
Chloe, what is this I've been hearing about you around town, about you and the prince? What is wrong with you? Huh? What is wrong with you? Why are you always acting like a woman, listening to every little gossip? Chloe, I asked you a question, okay? All right, okay, fine. What if I'm dating the prince? So? Huh? So? Oh, 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 so that is true. I'm uh, serving you in the house of my friends. Chloe, what is wrong with you? How am I even sure that I'm the father of that baby in your womb? What is wrong with you? You know what? I'm out of here. Don't worry. You come back here begging. I know you're tired. Love a boy. Mama, mama, yes. Obi. <laughs> mama Bian. Is that really you? Hey. Mama, mama. Obi. I told you people by the time I go to Medugu and come back, this will never be the same. Hmm? Mama, mama. There's nobody. Yes, You're not driving it. Mama. Ha. This, this has is, really changed. This is my car. Okay. Infinity. I told you I was going to buy Infinity. Infinity. Infinito. You mean this car is yours? Eh? Mama, mama, to you. This is my car. I want to be with This has Papa, really changed you. Yes, Papa. Thank you, Papa. It's the Lord's doing. The Lord has been wonderful. Huh? And it's marvelous in our sight. Amen. Huh? Amen. Yeah. Come on. Something is wrong. Something is missing. The key player of this house is not around. Okay, you mean my husband? He just went to... Yeah, Mama. I'm not talking of your husband. I'm talking of Obin. She just went to Cynthia's house now. Yeah, Mama, let me ask you. If you go to church to see a pastor, and when you get to the church, you don't see the pastor, what will happen? Maybe you go back to your... Maybe I know. Let me go and get the pastor before the church dismisses. I'll be back. Oh? Wait, wait, wait. No, where are you going now? I, I have something. Yeah, Mama, maybe I'll... Let me go and get my love, Olivia. Hey. Don't worry, by the time I'll, I'll come back, it's a migration. Because no Olivia, no celebration. Love, we're Mama, just don't go anywhere. Mm. Just stay here. Don't stay here. Don't hey. go anywhere. Hey! hey. 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 How will someone be playing the music of his car down? This person might. Yeah, you are coming to you. Eh? Who will best enjoy his car? Or will you be a poor and also be a witch? It's just that it's too loud. I bet the person bought it to me. That's why. Eh? Why is that guy coming to you? Come on. My poor man. No. Why is that guy coming to you? Hey! Hey! Jesus! Hey! What people have to sit on now? I said I want to tell you Wait, 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 wait Make it drop it, baby Say I want to tell you Go for fun Come on, I want to tell you Come on, I want to tell you Wait, 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 wait Drop it, baby Go for fun I want to tell you One of the young ones, the man She be you don't say that time Don't come for you to get the one, baby Every day or night I'll be pleased with the peace You'll be done so Be where you were Like you were I told you people that by the time I come back from Medu, this will never be the same. Walula, what? Hi! Oh, Jesus! How come? How come? How come? How Every time you call me, Obi, my heart will just melt. Oh, there is nothing like how come. 
The way God does his own thing is marvelous. Huh? You know, I'm so happy you for you. See, thank you very much. You can see that again. This is unbelievable. Because eh? enter this car, let's go and pull you. You can't own. You can't own. Anywhere you want to yeah. go. Let's go. <laughs> anywhere. <laughs> It is a chineke, it is a Mama, I'm ready to go. Uh-uh. Kudoka, -uh. I thought you were saying you were going down to the street to see a friend. Um, and you dress as if you are going far. I know, but I will still go far. How far are you going? I want to go and see Olivia. I talked to her how to meet with the prince. Is there anything wrong with you, Doc? Do you need a stick to pluck off your eyes before you know that a stick is dangerous to your eye? I... Mama, I know where you're going. Understand? Understand what? Listen, son, you have to stay away from this issue because it is bigger than us. And that was why you were thrown out of the palace. Mama, I will always be careful. I'm going to the girls' house, not the palace. Don't worry, your son will make you proud, eh? Mama, oh, don't worry, eh? Mama, smile for me. Uh-uh. Udoka, oh, be careful. Okay, Mama. Udoka, be careful, Udoka, be careful. Okay, Mama. Good Mama. like never before. Please, I beg you. He's not even answering my calls or returning my SMSs. My dear, it's not like I've been folding my arms or relaxing, no. I, I really want my son to marry you so that my noble family and yours will be more united. I beg you, Your Highness, please. I'll be very grateful, please. I've been talking to him. Just like he has not been listening. No, 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 Papa, keep talking. Okay, oh, this is your son. I know. I know. Ha. Olivia. Ma? That thing is not yet ripe now. What? No, there's ripe one inside. Inside where? Yes. Ah. Young man, how am I help you? Um, no, I came to see Olivia. Oh, what? He's one of the prince's guards. Yes, I was one of the prince's guards. Yeah. What happened? Um, see, Her Majesty laid an accusation on me to get me out of the palace because the prince has been asking about you and how to get to your house. Then what are you doing here? See, I, I came to take Olivia to where she will see the prince. Take Olivia? For what? You want them to kill my daughter? Pastor, you're not taking her anywhere. In fact, if you must know, go and tell them that my daughter is also getting married soon. No, man, it wasn't the princess's fault. It was her mom that is all behind all this. Because she, she thinks um, the prince will fall in love with Olivia if he regains his sight. Oh, so all this is because of poverty. Because we are poor. Yeah. Now, go and tell the prince and all of them that my daughter is also getting married soon. Mama! Hey, start of this. Young man, thank you very much. I appreciate everything. But my daughter is not going to die because of anybody. She's not going to risk her life because of the prince. No. Mama, no, no, I understand you too. Where are Oli? Come back here. Huh? Okay. Mom. Uh, Where are you going, man? You want them to? You have to open your eyes. Okay? Those people are wicked. I wouldn't allow them to kill you. It's not possible. Or do you want to die? Me, hey. please. Mommy, I beg you in the name of God. Just talk to James for me, please. I beg you. I promise you I'm going to stay with him this time around. Please, Mommy, I beg you. I beg you. Hmm. I told it's like father, like daughter. Why do you suddenly need the help of your mother? 
You told me you never want me to interfere in your affairs. Please hold it. Hold it there. Do you know what I see in all those things? You are looking confused. Totally confused. Who is doing that? Who? No one, mommy. Nobody, please. Please, please, don't say I want, mommy. I promise I'm going to stay this time. I won't mess up this one, please. Oh. Chloe. I'm just marveled at your guilt. The first woman to marry two men. Two men, Chloe. Two men. Excuse me. something bothering me. Um, this girl, Olivia, the one that comes here to sing for me. Do you know where she lives? Uh, yes, my friends. She's from Omaha village. But I don't actually know her house. But you, you, you know her village? Yes, She has done for me and watch her sing, sing for me once again. Omaha village. Where in Omaha village? Where do I start from? God, please help me. I'm looking for one girl, um, Olivia. Again? Again? Now, the same thing. Me, the way you see here, since yesterday, now, woman I wait for. He gave one girl when I call. Now, she are from my place, come find since yesterday. I they call her for phone, up to now. She, she tell me, say she they call, she they come. Now, here I sleep. Since yesterday, now, for this chair, I sleep. Up to now, the girl never come. I they wait for her. Now you might tell me say that woman, now you defy. Me, I, me, I, you don't because the same thing now. You go stay here, make the wait for her. At least we, by the time we sit down here, maybe we, the girl feel pass. You go from there, see her. Make you might help me, make with the discuss. Yeah, you yeah, you they find and go now. Oh, come, 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 we'll sit down too. Look, she feel pass, so. Oh. Follow me, sit down more. What she feel? Now from this village. Huh? Eh?
for a certain girl called um, Olivia. Olivia? In this village? Yeah, well, Umaha, yeah. Umaha village. Is she yellow or black? How? Actually, that I don't know. I, I, I can't tell, but. <laughs> I don't know. I, 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 Circumstances of life has coached to your side, and I know and I pray our chief will grant you back your sight. And I know Olivia, one right? day you will look at me. Yo, Olivia, I'll be looking I just. Don't worry, guys. Every day we're just asking but I don't have lost it before. I was just ready to, to hear the voice. The voice that. That voice that gave me hope. That voice that, voice that gave me hope. That voice. Okay. Let's see. I think I was going to be I promise I was coming for you. Mama Olivia, good evening. Good. Day I catch you. What is going on here? I come in peace. So, what can I do for you? Mama, I catch you. I trust what really happened. Papa, Mama, it's true. My prince, if that is the case, it's not your fault. You're welcome to my house. Thank you. Thank you. Prince. No. Ma, thank you. <laughs> don't you go have anything for the prince. I don't know if you manage what we have. Mama, I'm not going to manage anything you have, I'll take. Hey. That's good. Father, bless this food and take love in Jesus' name. Amen. She went out with the prince. The prince? Yes, the prince. So, so all these rumors I've been hearing about what you hear the prince. So it's true. Yeah. Rumor. So this is the reason why your daughter has been avoiding me. It's true. Mama, wait, Mama, wait, please. This is the reason why your daughter has been treating me like a, 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 a piece of rag. Eh? Uh, please, it's not what you think. What? What do you want me to think, Mama? It's just that the prince is a, a kind of appreciating Oliver for what he did. Mama, what kind of appreciation will the king will be giving to Olivia? That nobody can tell me. 
I heard all these things outside. Nobody told, how come nobody told me about all these things? And I was hearing them uh, from outside. I go, I go, I go, calm down. Okay. I, I go, calm down. Okay. You know what? No, it's okay. Oh, you, know, ask you, oh, you, you, don't, you don't have to live like this, man. Eh? Uma, are you sure you and your daughter is not conniving together? Conniving what? Why did you tell him that? Eh, 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 Olivia is cutting the prince. You are the cause of all this problem. You're asking me. I am. Eh? I know that something is going on. What is going on? If we miss this boy, I'm going to deal with you. What is going on? Don't Go ahead and eat your food. I got you. Papa Olivia. She doesn't even feel anything for me. She doesn't want anything to do with me. And I've been busy throwing myself at her. God. Who are you talking about? Who else if not your friend Olivia? Olivia. You see, you don't need to conclude yet. I mean, I, I know my friend very, very well. I know Olivia loves you. Spare me. what I keep on hearing all the time. That Olivia likes me. Olivia, yes, she doesn't want to give me attention. She doesn't even want to listen to me. I'm so tired. See, Obidke, you don't need to be tired, okay? Just, I plead of you. Give me this one more time. One more chance to speak to her. Believe me, she is going to respond to you. Stand you know what, you know, Cynthia? Cynthia, there is no need talking to Olivia. It's not necessary. Instead of wasting your time trying to convince Olivia to marry me, I want you to take that time and talk to yourself for me, please. Hey. Oh, okay. I, I don't understand you. I mean, what do you mean? I, I should talk to myself. For what? I don't know. I've been doing lots of thinking lately. You are a very pretty girl. You are a nice girl. You are homely. You have a good heart, just like your friend Olivia. I want you to take your time to talk to yourself. Okay, okay. I can see you are now crossing the boundary. Mm -hmm. No, 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 please. Okay, maybe I should be going now. We will Cynthia. talk some other time. Please. Cynthia, Cynthia, please wait. Wait, Cynthia.
What is wrong with you two? I should be asking you that question, Olivia. What is wrong with you? My God, what is wrong with everybody I know today? I came here to relieve my heavy heart of what Her Majesty and my parents put me through. But now I'm realizing that your own may be hot as well. Olivia, you are the one that is making things too hot for me. When you abandon your position with Obidike and you are here pursuing a lost shadow. Hmm? Please, better go and settle your case with that Obidike of a thing. He is seriously disturbing my peace. Mm, now I see you're in a mood. Obidike asked you to marry him and you're angry. Why? How do you manage to know that? <coughs> well, let's just say that um, I met him along the road and I told him to carry on after our last discussion. You see, I'm not serious, okay? Please, I don't have time for this. Marry you now, but you're always to take it look at to somewhere and I want us to go somewhere very important. Okay, let me tell I my husband. I should tell him. I know. Oh. Cynthia, I hope you've not started deceiving me like your friend Olivia. 
It's not that I don't like you. I do. By the truth. Cynthia. Huh. Look, I'm not a kid. Do you honestly think I've not thought about this? I have. You and I know that Olivia's heart belongs to another, not me. I've really tried here. I've, I've, I've really banged my head, but I've given up. See, Cynthia, my father used to tell me, if he would see the color of our future, we must look for it in our present. If we can gaze on the stars of our destiny, we will look for it deeply in our hearts. Come on. Baby, you are so romantic. And your words have a way of suiting my heart. See, Cynthia, our destiny can be examined, but it cannot be totally justified or explained. Just relax. Let's just leave this in the hands of God. See, if God is with us, if he supports us, everything will be fine. Just relax. Circumstances of life has coached to your side, and I know and I pray our chief will grant you back your sight. And I know one day you will look at me and recognize who I am. I'm raising more, I'm raising more, I'm raising more. You got who I am, you saw. I'm raising more, I'm raising more. I praise him, no. He got her on you, so I praise on you. Me, you go, hey. I praise him, no. He got her on you, so I praise on you. Me, you go, hey. I praise him, no. He got her on you, so. Don't worry, enjoy the day. You're losing all your empathy.